time, right? It's usually in moment where I feel very like vulnerable and weak and something in me urges me to be stronger and write about it and like stop being the victim of emotions and stop fearing them and just like transforming these dark moments into something more positive, which is art. When I started doing music, I didn't really know it was gonna be a thing for me. So I was writing from like, oh, whatever, it's just a hobby. And then people actually liked these songs and I felt like a horrible person because I was like, well, this is not me. So then I had to do like a complete backflip and start taking it seriously. What I actually want to do is sing that touch me and that feel real and honest. I can't go out there every night and like pretend to have emotions in front of people. It was really hard like three weeks ago when I released the new record and it was still like so personal and all about like childhood tragedy and like dreams and visions and things that I had when I was a kid that I never like talked about. But because it's so 100% I wanted to do and I put you know every bit of like sweat and soul and cracks and failures and mistakes and I don't feel like oh they don't like me they're totally right I should have done better it's like oh well, I did what I wanted to do good morning when I was a kid I really thought that I didn't belong in my family because I didn't connect with anyone. Everything that made me like a human being, which is like having different tastes or you know, liking different things, suddenly it's like you're being the biggest pain in the ass. It's like, well, why do you have to like the same thing that everybody does? Like, why can you not be entitled to your own taste and opinion? find meaning in absolutely everything. But I like art to like give a taste of that, to like whether people who have not experienced um, things that you're going through or people that need help, like comfort, that knowing that what they're going through, you're also going through. You gave sense to my life too. I simply could not go on with my life if I was not that productive because I need to get rid of things in my brain in order to move on. My dad died when I was a kid, so, you know, having like such an early on conscious of mortality definitely conditions you to becoming a certain type of person. Like, I guess either not care at all or either, in my case, like wanting to grab every bit of life and like make the most of it, always. Yeah. 